today's news deals with some tough subjects, so you might not want your children in the room. We begin with Glee star Mark Salling, found dead of an apparent suicide. The troubled actor was just weeks away from being sentenced for possession of child pornography. Here are the latest details. Just before noon today, the coroner removed the body of actor Mark Salling from a remote area north of Los Angeles. The actor's car was parked nearby. He apparently committed suicide. Salling was set to be sentenced in March after pleading guilty to possession of child pornography. His agreement stated that a search warrant found more than 50,000 images of child pornography on his computer and a thumb drive. The 35-year-old was expected to receive a prison sentence from between four to seven years. A source close to the actor tells us last year he checked into rehab after a suicide attempt. Salling ended a relationship with co-star Naya Rivera in 2010. She told us in 2016 she wasn't shocked by his arrest. He always was a very dark soul to me. Um, and I always felt like, you know, just from knowing him so well, I guess, uh, for the on and off three years, um, I just always felt like there was something that he was wrestling with. Salling had remained in seclusion since being charged. Of course, Salling shot to fame as bad boy Noah Puckerman on Glee. Puck is a jock, obviously. It's fun to play the jerk, you know, and, and you, you don't have to make him likable. Surrender. You book this show and you start doing it and you put it together, do you have any idea what it would turn into? Uh, absolutely not. One more time, Mark. This was Salling's last big public appearance at the Viper Room relaunch in 2015. His attorney released a statement this morning saying, quote, Mark was a gentle and loving person, a person of great creativity, who was doing his best to atone for some serious mistakes and errors of judgment.